Hi, my name is Leandro and today I'm going to show you how to create a new lookup for when you have a custom application. So, first of all, let me show you my custom application here. Its name is Serial Number and I have three records for Serial Number. I have just a Serial Num, Description and if it's active or not. So now let's go to the domains application. Then I'm going to show you the table domain created for this application. The work clause is just a uh, active x to 1. And um, in database configuration, I attached this new table domain to the serial number field of asset object. So let's bring up asset here, serial number. Here you see the serial num domain attached to this attribute in database. So what most people do here is say, oh I don't have a lookup for my serial number application. So I'm gonna use an existing one. So they open the properties of the of the field and they add value list there. So let's try and add value list here and save. So now when you go to the application and you try to open this lookup, you're gonna find uh, invalid binding in the dialog. So now people say, what should I do? And the reason for that is that this column is not recognized by Maximo, the custom column. So you have to create a new lookup. So you have to go to application designer and export the lookup.xml file. Let's save it and open in a tax editor application. Now you see the lookups XML file and now let's create our new custom lookup here. So the ID is the name of the object, serial number. Now the name of my first attribute here, serial num, and the ID for the first column. Now the name of the second attribute here, description, and the ID for the column 2. And the third attribute here will be the active for the column 3. Okay, now let's copy this new lookup and page and paste it to the lookups XML file. Now let's save it and import it back to Maximo. Now let's open the asset application again in application designer and change the lookup from value list to serial num, which is our new lookup here. Now let's save the chains here. And it's already done f f to test, so let's open the assets application. Let's open the serial number here, and now it's perfect. The three new columns, it's bringing up the, the related values as expected. The serial number, the description, and the active columns. So that's all for today, guys. Thank you, and bye-bye.